All right, we're here with Anthony Pandy. Pandy, you said that the field drills is where you think that you thrive the most. Talk about that a little bit, about Pro Day 2022 field drills here. Um, Pro Day was honestly a great day for everyone, not just myself, I feel like. But uh, field drills, I feel like mostly that's where everyone excelled at because we're all ball players. Um, so I feel like it comes natural to us, You're especially Trey Mason. <laughs> Trey Mason did really good on them field drills. <laughs> We were walking over here and you said that you wanted those field drills to keep going because you felt like that's just where your talent lies, right? I mean, mm -hmm. break that down a little bit for us. I mean, I just feel like I'm an athlete, I'm a football player. Realistically, I'm on the field making plays and that's what I want to do and excel at. So that's why I wanted to keep showing them like on the field, I'm, I'm making plays, I'm moving efficient, moving well, fluent. So yeah, I wanted them to keep going. You wanted them to keep going. Okay, well hopefully they're going to keep going for you in the future here. Mm -hmm. But let's talk about the training that you went through the last couple of months. What were you doing? Kind of elaborate on that to get ready for today. Um, my hips were like really tight coming out of winter break. So uh, my first training session, first couple of weeks weren't so like uh, weren't so fluid. Okay. So we worked a lot on uh, that kind of stuff, just loosening my hips, getting my full extension through my back legs, um, getting my glutes right, getting the legs right, uh, power into the ground, stuff like that. So, yeah, that's what I needed to work on the most, I felt like, because I knew the field stuff was going to be pretty smooth. So, yeah, that's what I did a lot. Did you follow any strict diet? Uh, I eat pretty clean. I'm, like, I don't really eat like, a lot of red meat, no junk, no dairy. So, I didn't really have to change my diet. All right. Do you have any last words for your Arizona football fans in the Tucson community here? Um, thank you all for a great college career. Thank you all for accepting me as a Wildcat and supporting me and my team. Um, and, yeah, bear down for life.